had a little impromptu garden cleanup today. Really, all I did was get the big um, sunflowers down. They were falling down from the wind, and I don't know if you can see it. Right out there, we're burning some trees that had fallen in the storm like almost three years ago now. Finally got around to dragging them out there, got our permit, and then we never got snow this winter and it was windy and there were red flag warnings. So we had rain for the past couple days. So we thought we better take advantage and get that stuff burned up before we need to get into this field. But I was looking at a few things here. When I was picking some stuff out, the garlic is popping through all these layers of straw all the way down. So that's kind of reassuring that I do indeed have garlic this year. Coming through there in a bunch of places. So before too long, I'm gonna have to get my fencing up because as soon as I take this fence, you know, great fence off of here, the chickens are gonna go crazy because they love them some straw. And I'm just gonna spread all that straw out, thin it out a little, leave it in there for the weeds, but spread it out and take all the straw out of the strawberries over here. There's these weird rogue ones. I'm guessing this is from like last year's crop, maybe left over that I didn't get pulled out or possibly the bulbils. This is a little bit thicker straw over here, but you can see stuff coming out. So they are ready to go. And the rhubarb also getting ready to go and my old Halloween decorations need to be picked up. A couple other things that I noticed. I should check all these actually. Looks like that one's doing and that one's good. Some of them got a little picked over last year is making sure they were still going to come up. But over here I noticed my sorrel is coming back, which it is a perennial, but the last two years ago when I planted it, it was ah, cats. It was in a bad place, um, so it never came back up, but this one is coming up. Also, I think there's probably a lot of lettuce coming up there, little bits. We'll see how that does. So far, I mean, the big pile of snow that was in here only just melted the other day with the rain. And we definitely haven't had it warm again since the snow. And I really got to clean all this up before I end up with oodles of amaranth. But what do we got here? The chives are starting to green up. I have a weird random snap peas. Kind of funny. I'm not going to clean this stuff up until it's warmer out. And then I'm going to fill these beds with some compost before I do anything. And I promise I will not leave volunteer things quite so everywhere <laughs> this year. But you know how promises are. Who knows? And I did see, ooh, I see a broken plant marker. Let me sneak over here. The crocus, these, these suckers were under all that snow and did just fine. And now I see this purple one over there. This one's starting to come up. Daffodils, some stuff in there. Somewhere way back there, there's a broken, or maybe just tipped out of the ground. The little, um, these are golf tees with a little jewel on them. Really, Chico, helping. Anyway, looking forward to getting this all cleaned up and definitely gonna try and get rid of some of these 
rid of back yet. We don't need that much. That's a little ridiculous. <laughs> but soon it will be spring. Definitely did not plant any potatoes over um, Good Friday because this was three feet of snow. So it does look like some, I'm guessing these are hollyhocks are growing in my potato patch. But maybe I can find a different spot for potatoes this year. We'll see. I think it's actually spring finally.